the, there are a lot of challenges because when they are looking at the organic fair trade market, according to them, they say there's only a 15 to 20 percent market. There's a 20 percent demand for this. Now, these companies are getting, going ahead with the certifications. You know, they're got certified, they're fair trade certified, and now they have to keep renewing these licenses every year. And when you say you're a fair trade company, you have to ensure that all your dues to the employee is paid on time. You're giving them fair wages. There's fire and sa safety and security and things like that. Now, the companies, from their point of view, they're saying is if they are to follow all these practices, they want a better market for it, not just a 20% market share. Because the conventional market is so huge that it's very easy for companies to say, I don't want to get into all these certifications. I would rather do the conventional business. You know, so it is the responsibility of the brands and the end consumer, that's you and me, to show some responsibility and support these suppliers who follow the GOTS, fair trade, upcycling, recycling processes. I think that would benefit a lot.